Starting off with a super cute red bleb today. I need to shrink this guy down to about this size. That way we can make some red crystals just coming off the top of his head. Probably a little bit like that. I think that's perfect. Now, apparently the last build was a little bit too easy. I thought it was gonna be hard. Everyone said, nah, Finn, that was way too easy, champ. It's Sans from Undertale. So at the moment, we've got a white bleb. We have a red spiky thing coming off his head. This is gonna be a little bit more difficult, this one. It's gotta be challenging, all right? Let's shrink this guy down. We need to get some white on there as well. It's, it's actually more difficult than you think to make something that isn't too hard, but is also just hard enough. Okay, are you guys guessing what this is? I know some of you guys are able to guess these things like normally right away. Hope this one's at least a little bit challenging. All right, then I'll get this out here like that. How's that looking? Well, that's not looking too bad. Got to be careful not to break it. Don't break it, Finn. All right, this is looking pretty good. It's a bit of an odd shape. Maybe that'll just add to the challenging part of it, all right? Oh, this is so many crystals. The game is slowing down so much. And I thought Sands was heaps of crystals. So like always, guys, if, if you don't know what I'm doing, if this is the first time you're tuning in to watch me do this weird crystal garbage on this bleb, <laughs> I'm actually building a video game character. And I want you guys to guess what character it is, maybe what game it's from. Okay, there it is there. That's... That's about as good as I can get with like a multicolored blimp. Maybe I'll change his color a little bit to something else. I need fluid hand, but at the same time, I can't put him down because he'll probably break. Oh, there we go. That works. Put some color in there. Can we? Oh, hey, he's brown now. Eh, that kind of works. <laughs> All right, guys, let me know in the comments. What video game character is this blimp? All right, I'm gonna throw that guy away. You notice there's actually a bleb in here who's kind of bouncing around, and then he turns into like a solid sphere. <laughs> I don't know why. I've kind of modded this game a little bit too much. Alrighty, cool, we've got the stickium. Now, I just need to shrink Lee Tan's head. There we go. Shrink it right down until it's pretty much gone. Where's your head? <laughs> <laughs> All right, what I thought we would do is actually try and replace Lee Tan's head with a bleb. I, just, I don't know if that's going to be possible, but we're going to give it a shot. All right, so let's get a bleb here. Let's get this little guy. Oh, sticky bleb. All right, and we're just going to try and place it on Lee Tan's head. You turn around. Hey, Prison. Hey. hey. Oh, that sort of Thanks. sort of worked. Whoa, he's such a mess. What happens when you make these guys super big and then splat them? Really big bleb. Ugh. <laughs> it's like a giant beanbag thing. Cool. Whoa. Come on, stop trying to steal my bleb. I'm trying to... Where's his face? Oh. Whoa. Okay, what? did that work? Hmm. What's going on? Some weird glitchy mess. Yeah. It's kind of not really sticking to Lee Tan too well. <laughs> All right, you stay like that, little champ. Hey, Blort. I've changed Blort's resizability that? so that he doesn't bounce back straight away. So we should be able to resize him like this. Whoa, he's gone yellow. Why have you gone yellow? Oh, no. <laughs> so it turns out if you shrink Blort the wrong way, he actually crashes the game completely. So I'm just going to shrink him just a little bit. <laughs> We're just going to make him short and stubby like this. He's like a weird looking little bit of broccoli. How's it going there, dude? All right, let's make him big. Now he's like massively top heavy. Hey. Oh my god. Can we do it to Professor Plapu as well? Giant Plapu. All right, there we go. Giant teacher. The teacher sees everything. So we can paint the students as well. I've just painted Lee Tan like yellow. Probably paint her like purple. Although she's already purple. There you go. Have a little bit of purple. What about red? Super creepy red. Whoa, that's weird. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. Let's get some water. Regular old water. See if we can clean them up. Yeah, cool. Okay, let's get some more science liquids. Oh, if you guys are wondering where my face cam is today, I had some problems with my green screen. So that's why it's it's not there. You don't get to see my beautiful face today. Even though it's normally covered by a VR headset. Bouncium. That's the stuff that I want. Oh, you're back to your normal size. Okay. Let's just make you... Oh, oh. Make you big. Oh, bouncium. Let's throw that at him. Whoa, bounces off him so well! Yeah, cool. Alright. Whoa. I almost. Got that one. almost. <laughs> I love how Blord can't catch him. things. It's the funniest. Okay, can we make Specs bouncy? Whoa. Oh, Specs has just gone completely blue. Hey! 
High fives! Okay, I'm gonna change over to... Oh, maybe Tornado Hand works... So works on her. Like Does that... Tiny oh, sorta works? Power. You can push them away. All right, so some of you guys had some brilliant ideas on the last video to see if we're able to backpack specs. I don't know if that's gonna be possible. It's gonna get friends bubble blower. Chuck that in my backpack, that'll be super useful. I'm gonna get some spicium as well. See if we can use some spicium on some of the students. Put it in my backpack. Alrighty there, specs. Time to get bubbled. Let's give this a shot. Uh, I'm gonna get this thing out of here. Is that... It's busted. There's no bubbles in it. Look at that, it's just a hoop. Oh. It's working again. Okay, so if we can successfully bubble specs, we might be able to get her in our backpack because that's how you you get things in your backpack. You have to, unless you could just go like, oh no. <laughs> specs? <laughs> oh, that's bad. That is really bad. Oh, cool. I can go like this behind my back and it appears there. Uh, is Specs in there? Specs, are you, are you in there at all? Oh, that's bad. That is bad. Um. I think I'm in trouble. I think Spex has gone to a dimension she cannot come back from. Let's see if we can do it with Blort. Maybe Blort can go in there and find where Spex is. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. He just fell out. Oh dear. Oh, he's rolling around. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> Are you okay, dude? It's very slippery, that chair, isn't it? Look what happened to- <laughs> He's upside down. Let's get some spicium. And go ahead and pour it on Blort, who happens to be upside down at the moment. Here, have some spicium. Have the spicium. Oh, I might need to spray him. Is that working? Is it? Does that work? Oh yeah, I can breathe fire. It is. Oh, he just rolled in the paint. <laughs> I'm doing blops with Blort. Woo! You can push him around. Okay. Whoa, whoa! Get in the backpack. Get in the backpack. Okay. Is he in the backpack? Yeah, I think he's gone. <laughs> okay, backpacking your friends with Empire. All right, get in there. Get in. Get in the backpack. Hey, <laughs> that is weird. No, stand up. Whoa, yeah, turning the teacher into tornado. <laughs> Turn around! I'm just trying to flip her over. Okay, hopefully if I leave and come back, all the students come back as well. Oh, Specs is right there. Oh no. Oh no, they're permanently in my backpack. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> I've deleted the characters by putting them in my backpack for good. Okay, given that I've broken visual edits for now, who is that in there? Oh. Oh, it's Nesk. If you look at Nesk through, like, your backpack, you can see his weird shadowies on the inside. That's cool. So I thought it would be cool to see if we can get Sunspot to actually eat a blab. Beep beep. <laughs> he definitely looks at the blab. Hey, there's a blab. Check him out. You guys are both the cutest things in this game. What do you reckon? Look at that. Best of buddies. All right, now eat him. Let's go like that and then eat him. Eat him. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he wants to eat him. He wants to eat the blab now. Oh, he's gone. Oh, oh no. Job. And then he pooped him out. That used to be a blab. That's the scariest thing ever. Come on, eat this. You just ate it again. Just eat this entire snacks box. There you go. This is food too. There you go. It's all food. Everything. Everything is food. Whoa, on his face! I just realized you can spray Sunspot in the face. He spits back. You can swallow that. Watch this. <laughs> that is gross. That is so gross. Okay, so Sunspot eats blebs. That what we've established. Do blebs eat blebs? There's an edible bleb. Let's just throw him on the ground there. Okay. He is edible. Let's get another bleb. Like a blatte. Oh, I just he ate him instantly. Alright. Let's. What? How did you eat him? He was really far away. Okay, let's put him put him over there. All right, he's coming. He's coming. Don't eat him. How close does he have to be to eat him? Oh, he hasn't eaten him. Okay, I stand here. He just ate him. Blebs will eat blebs. Okay, so you guys have seen me stick blebs together before. I'm gonna try and see how many I can actually get stuck together. So let's go ahead and feed that one. Yeah, that guy looks super cute. I think I've successfully made all of the blebs. Oh, maybe not that one. What about this one? Oh, I don't even know how you can coat these ones. Oh, hang on. Oh, no, he's definitely sticky. All right, that's good. Can we stick you two together? <laughs> he just goes orange. Oh, there we go. I can't tell what's happening there. He's an orange ball. Oh, that works. Okay, you guys stick together. Hey, cool. Yeah, that's a cool look. Uh, we'll go like that. Okay, we've got two blebs. All right, let's get another one. Uh, let's go just a regular bleb. All right, they're stuck, very much stuck to the ground. Can we get third? 
Yeah, cool. We've got a bleb three thing going on. All right. Uh, let's get a love bleb. Oh, he's flying. Yes. Hey, cool. Oh, that one's busted. All right, let's try again. It's the second bleb that I pull out of my pack that works. All right, let's go. Let's go. A fourth one. Whoa. Whoa. It's a disgusting mishmash of blebs. Oh, maybe we can get an ultimate bleb in there somehow. Oi, come back. All right. That one doesn't work. Let's get this other one. This one should work. Yes. And go. Five blebs. What even is this thing? At least it flies. So that's pretty good. Oh, a tele bleb. Maybe we could get them all teleporting. Uh, oh no. Oh no, 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 it's okay. Uh, he's definitely stuck though. It's a disgusting blob thing. Ooh, sparkle bleb. Nice. Void bleb. Don't drop them because they just splat. <laughs> Are you guys keeping count of how many blebs is in this weird bleb world? I, I don't know how many that is. Ooh, metal bleb. Okay, he just jams in there like a big metal sphere thing. All right, molten bleb. Nice. Whoa, come back. Whoa, where's he going? Oh no, it just fell on the ground. What is that? What even is this thing? Where's it going? It's like a comet. All right, you go to the ground. Let's get another one. Oh no, it's taking off. Where's it going? Come back. Why is this one just like stuck to the side? That's weird. Oh yeah, cool. It's like my bleb wad now has a face. I need something heavy to weigh him all down. There we go. Oh no, it's like a shooting star of bubbles. It's gone. It's actually gone. It, it took a star with it? How did, how, what? What are the stars? You can take these? <laughs> I didn't even know this was an object that you could use. What even is it? What's this? What's this say? I wish the Prismy has a wonderful day. Smiley face. Oh, these things are cool as. They're just like anti-gravity. Okay, so what you do is you can actually take a photo of stuff and then you look at the back of it and it tells you what it is. Take a photo of a star. Shooting star. Make a wish. Also featured was a bleb. Oh yeah, there's a bleb down there. So you can just yeet the star. Whoa, cool. I just realized Zanisha's probably one of the only characters that's managed to get away without being dunked in science sauce. Yeah, high five, how's it going? I wonder if we can get a bleb to eat Zanisha. Oh yes, there we go. Zanisha's edible. It'd be a shame if a bleb was to eat you. Here we go, I'm just gonna throw this bleb over there. Oh, the bleb's gonna eat you, Zanisha. It's gonna eat you. No, no, didn't get eaten. All right, what if I just hold him out like this? Come on, eat Zanisha. No, come on. <laughs> All right, let's get some more blips until one of them eats Zanisha. Oh, oh, it's chasing her. <laughs> just gonna throw some blabs just on the ground here. There we go. Come on, one of them's gotta eat Zanisha, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nah, they can't do it. Inedible. Oh, what if I went like this? Oh, eat, 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 and eat. All right, guys, like always, if there's any crazy stuff you want to see me try in this game, let me know in the comments. And thank you very much for watching this video. I'll catch you guys next time.